probably well into the 27-28 range. Oh! Zadorov, big, huge hit on Shifley. That's the second time he clobbered Shifley this game, and the Jets have had enough. Oh, they went immediately after him. What an open ice hit by Zadorov. Second time in this game that he has crunched Mark Shifley, their best player. Now, there, remember, there's going to be one more game this year between these two teams in Winnipeg in early March. That was Truba who came to the defense of Shifley. Well, Michael, the, the, what's going to be interesting here? I watched it. I saw it. Was he high? Was he high on the hit, and is he going to be gone? They're getting together to look at this. He is taller, certainly, than Shifley. Shifley was taking the puck. Now watch, where does he get him? Does he target the head? That's the whole thing. Mm. You know, it doesn't look like he targeted the no. head, the head no, I, on that hit. He just stepped into him. Yeah, Here, here's in slow motion. What do you think, Peter? Well, well, when you, you see that, you see that motion, you, there is contact with the head. It's contact to the head, but Shifley right there. Yep. But he, he wasn't charging at him. I mean, if this is going to be, I have not seen the referees go over yet. Just a sec, Mike. I'll try it here. Referee is explaining it right now. Well, that's the linesman, Johnny Murray, number right. 95 there, talking to the coaching staff of the Avalanche. Now, Truba is going to be gone. For third. He, Shifley, when you see that replay, he never saw Zadora, did he? No. Until the hit came. Watch it. See, he's looking towards his left at the last moment. He could feel Zadora was standing right there for the hit. I mean, you, you know, I mean, that is a really hard, hard hit. And I, I mean, you know, it's. So the only penalty on Zadora is going to be two minutes for charging, plus he gets the five minutes for fighting. Druba is going to get two minutes for instigating, five for fighting, and then the automatic misconduct. 